Sheet lamination. Sheet lamination is a process in which sheets of material are bonded and cut to create a 3D object. A blade or a laser is used to draw or cut the desired geometry profile using the supplied digital data. The bonding medium or method to join two sheets can vary from material to material. Paper and plastic material usually uses adhesive and heat to join the sheets. Metal sheets are usually bound together using ultrasonic welding. Ultrasonic welding uses high frequency ultrasonic acoustic vibrations which are locally applied to the sheet of metal being held together under pressure to create a solid state weld. It is commonly used for joining similar or dissimilar sheets of metals. This process is also called as ultrasonic additive manufacturing. UAM requires additional CNC machining and removal of the unbound metal during the welding process. The most popular name for the sheet lamination additive process is laminated object manufacturing. LOM is commonly used with paper and plastic material. Basic LOM 3D printers comprise following parts. Material spools roll the sheet of material onto the build platform. One side of the roller supply the sheet and the other side extracts the waste portion after the cutting operation. Heated roll. Heated roller applies heat and pressure to join the two sheets where the sheet is generally coated with adhesive. Laser and optics unit. Laser unit generally comprises laser, reflected mirror and galvo motor system. Laser unit directs the laser beam through a reflected mirror and the associated galvo motor system. Navigates laser on the sheet lamination to cut the specified geometry profile. Note, some printers use blade or cutter to cut the geometry profile. Blade is attached to the traverse system which allows it to move in the XY plane parallel to the build platform. Build platform. Build platform supports sheet material and the object being printed. The platform moves vertically in the Z axis with the associated elevator mechanism. Workflow. 3D digital data is supplied to the printer similar to other additive processes. The sheet material with coated adhesive is rolled over and positioned on the build platform. The sheet material is bounded over the previous using pressure and heat applied through the heated roller. The required shape geometry is then cut from the layer by laser or a blade. After one layer is formed, the build platform is lowered by the layer thickness and the new sheet is then rolled over the platform. The process is repeated until the whole model is complete. Once printing is complete, part is removed from the build platform and any excess material is removed using manually without the need of special tools. Object printed in paper can be sanded or painted. Note: Paper objects are usually sealed with a paint or lacquer to keep out moisture. Whilst the structure quality of parts is limited, adding adhesive paint and sanding can improve the appearance and life. Materials Effectively, any sheet material capable of being rolled and bonded. Paper, plastic and some sheet metal such as aluminium, copper, stainless steel and titanium. The most commonly used material is paper and then plastics. Advantages Fastest and inexpensive process to create 3D prototypes. Ease of material handling Disadvantages Not ideal for complex geometry parts Not suitable for structure parts due to limited strength provided by the adhesive Poor accuracy and finish Post-processing needed to achieve the desired effect Required subtractive process to form a 3D object Limited material use and higher material waste Applications Primarily for creating scaled and conceptual prototypes towards form and fit testing of the design. It can also be used to make pattern 
for use in traditional manufacturing such as sand mold casting.